Hey Pisces, thank you for checking out my channel for the love of water to row. It's your girl Keonti and I'm ready to bring us a reading. It could be about anything knowing us, but it will be for the Pisces, the baby sharks, sun, moon, rising, and Venus, as well as the Pisces cross watcher. If you have Pisces anywhere in your chart, it'll resonate somewhere, I guarantee it, okay? <clears throat> Guys, remember this is a general reading, so every last single thing I say, because I will say a lot, won't resonate for every last single one of you. Please use your intuition and your discernment and put yourself where you go in the energy. If I get it right for you, baby sharks, make sure you take care of your girl with the like, comment, subscribe, and a share. And if you're interested in booking me for a private reading, my email information will be provided in the description box below the video. I am getting back, getting my energy back and getting back up and at them. So I will be working on private readings at today as well. All right, Pisces, I am going to use a new deck. It's not new. I've been had it, but I'm, this is going to be my first time using it for us. And we're going to see what comes up, but I'm going to start off in a way that we're very familiar with, okay? Just bear with me. I had a lull. I really, I, my energy dropped for like a few days, but I'm definitely doing much better. I hope you guys are doing great too. Ooh, y'all see how mysterious these cards are? Okay. I'm going to let y'all see it with me. Hopefully, if I can get this angle right. Ooh, wee. Underneath the deck, we have in their head. So there's definitely someone very much stressed out that's overthinking, stressed, and overanalyzing. Okay, we don't know what's going on yet. Let's see. Ooh. Pisces, why? Why it always got to be like this for us? <laughs> I'm just going to call it how I see it. I'm going to call it plain. And simply, we're going to work through it together. Pisces. Again, put yourself where you go in a, in a, in a, in a read because I can only see what's happening. You you could go anywhere in this. This may not be happening to you at all. This could be happening to someone in your soul tribe. But I do see somebody getting a little karma. There's some, you could be dealing with the Libra for sure, but there's someone definitely very much stressed out in their head. They're getting a little karma. This person was some sort of spiritual hater here, Pisces. It was a hater of yours or just a hater in general. This is a hater getting karma and being stressed out and in their head about it in the recent past. I feel like some of this could be happening currently. But I definitely see somebody who was a bit of a hater, right? This could have been somebody who hates on your spirituality, your light, your magic, your power, right? It was just somebody that was just a hater. I feel like they got their comeuppance. They're getting comeuppance. That's just, just what it feels like. And it feels like someone's now stressing in their head about it. Yep. They want to come towards you and make some sort of offer. With shine under here, Pisces, it could be something that you was aware of all along. Something that you were right about all along, right? It could have been somebody who you tried to give good advice to, right? You tried to talk to about karma and lessons and justice and right from wrong, but they just couldn't get it. I don't know why I'm getting holier than thou. Pisces, this could have been somebody when you tried to get them good advice about doing something, they could have got defensive like you're just being holier than thou. Like, how do you know it's right from wrong? I don't know why I'm getting that, Pisces, for sure. I'm getting it, though. And I feel like this person is now stressed out in their head because they want to come towards you with some sort of offer. But shine is under there. You're aware of something. You could have been right all along. Yep, there, yep, there they come. But let, let's just, let's go, Pisces. We're going to move through it. This is what I'm seeing happening in the recent past could even be still happening. What I'm having, ha what I'm seeing happening in the current Pisces is this hater is now a little bit salty balls at you. Pisces, this could definitely be a situation where you try to tell somebody right from wrong, right? You try to give someone good advice, right? Someone could literally, someone literally could have been hating on you because you were trying to do the right things and they wanted to go a thing. Like, you know, I don't know. I just feel like some of you, it was someone hating on your spirituality your light your magic or your power i feel like this person is definitely salty balls because you're ignoring them this is someone holding a grudge because you're ignoring them pisces this is what the energy is telling me they're in their heads right because pisces i feel like they feel some type of way because it's something that you no longer want to hear right but i feel but i feel like in the past you with justice you tried to school them pisces you could have tried to school them right but I just feel like there was a real resistance against, like, 
about the right thing. Could even be a legal issue. Put it where it goes. Well, Pisces, here's what's interesting for the future energy, guys. Y'all watch me shuffle these cards. I have the page of swords and blocked. <laughs> it literally is telling me, Pisces, for some of you, it's just as simple as somebody watching you from a fake account online. You see it. Fake account and block. Somebody you blocked that's watching you from a fake account. Literally. But this is the page of swords and like the seven of wands. So it's like someone definitely being... Having an energy of definitely the page of swords is a, is a snoop, right? It's a spy. It's also an inquisitor. So I feel like I don't know, like what but the block feels like the energy you're giving it because ignoring is a block, right? Watching and still being ignored. Holding a grudge because they're still they're still feeling blocked or something like that. Ooh, we Pisces. I just call it. Y'all put it where it goes. Like, comment, subscribe, and share if I'm getting it right. These are just the energies I'm getting, Pisces. Please let me know if it's resonating. I definitely read y'all comments, but I see this. And don't get don't kill the messenger, because some of y'all be extra spicy in them comments with me. I, I, I just read energy, huh? I just read energy. I, you can't, I can't control anyone else's energy any more than you can, right? Why get mad at me? Because they're watching you from a fake account. <laughs> I'm not telling them to do it. I'm, t I'm telling you they're doing it, though, for some of you, for sure. So let's get these. Are, these cards are fairly new. We're going to work with them because I do want to get familiar and get the messages off of them. I feel ready for them now. So give me one on the past for the legal issue and the spiritual hater for Pisces. Give me one on that past energy. They gave me two, but I'll take them. The current. For the baby shark spirit. Make it plain for me. The current. One. Can I handle two? I can handle one more. Give me one more. And future energy. That one popped right out. One more. Ooh, and that and these two popped out together. I'm gonna keep them. Underneath the deck, I have justice. Mm-hmm. Again, I'm telling you, some of you are definitely dealing with the Libra. That could be a legal situation with someone that stressed the F out now. Because I do feel like I don't know, Pisces. I don't know. I feel like you could have. You have to. I feel like you could have definitely gave great advice, whether legal or otherwise. I just feel like there could be a lesson in karma, and I do feel like in some form, way, shape, form, or fashion, like things could be. Could, you could like be getting justice because you do. You try to do things in a just way, and it could be someone who was a hater of the kind of energy you have for that, right? But I just see this person being very, very stressed out. Let's see what we have here. Essence. And vision. Ooh we this this is the lovers here. Gemini energy for sure. In the past. You see, Pisces, well, yeah, well, vision like Pisces, I feel like listen, some of you definitely like that high priestess energy. This could definitely be somebody like you think you know everything, right? Why do you think you would know everything? Or why do you think you know the right thing to do? Pisces, I do feel like with justice in this vision, you the way you saw things were the right way, but they didn't like that, right? Yeah, spiritual hater, the essence of it, right? The essence of oh Pisces, what is this about? Yes, somebody was hating on your on your essence, the essence of you, Pisces, the way you saw things, the way you wanted. Like I feel like you saw things the right way. I just cannot stress enough that. I don't feel like you were wrong, and I hate to say it like that because we're not self righteous. But if this is resonating for you and you knew and you know who I am, I feel like. There's a strong um, sense of right or wrong. And I'm talking about universal laws, right, Pisces? I do feel like there's things like your vision. You try to put forth a, a vision, a just vision for some ish. And this person was a hater on, on, uh, of the essence of that for sure. But I feel like now they're getting justice and karma. I feel like they're, they're, they're definitely witnessing karma. Yes, yes. I feel like this person is witnessing karma. Yes. Let me write that down, Pisces. Because I feel like this is what's happening right now. They're witnessing karma. That's what justice is, right? I feel like you had a vision for, for what could have been right, but they hated on that. They hated on the essence of what you were trying to imprint into a situation. And now they're stressed out. What's going on in the current? Because I see it. Loyalty. It could definitely be dealing with an earth sign. And what is this? Is this seeing? Is this seeing? Let me see, y'all. Because I'm a little blind, but not all the way blind. Yes. This is saying loyalty. Okay. Okay, Pisces. So in the current, this person is holding a grudge, right? Because you, you no longer want to hear them. These cards are telling me 
Now, now this person wants to wants to sing a song of loyalty to you. I want, I feel like they want to they want to sing it out to the rooftops. They want to they want to sing your praises. Yes, they want to sing your praises. They want to sing some sort of. And literally, there could be something about a singer here. Put it where it goes. And some of you are ignoring somebody's song. Somebody's ignoring a singer song on the radio. Mm -hmm. I, I just heard Rice and Tiller. I hope she's waiting for me. Everywhere she goes, they play in my song. That's why I say the things that I say. That way I know you can't ignore me. So, so. It's called Exchange by Bryce and Tiller. Give me all of you in exchange for me. Yeah, this is what someone wants to do now, but you're ignoring this. Give me all of you in exchange for me. For me. I don't have to listen to that. <laughs> yes. This is what you're, you're not wanting to hear that right now. I see it. I see it. You're not wanting to hear it. They want to sing praises of loyalty. They could definitely be an earth sign, a stubborn earth sign. Ooh -wee. So let's see what this future energy is about. Let's see. I have four cards came down for it. Let's see. Let me see. I may need some help because, again, I am blind, but I will get there, Pisces. We will get there together. Ooh, this is let go. Ooh-wee. Dance portal, let go. Okay, so you 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 dancing to somebody else's music now? <laughs> That's let go. Which ooh we manifestation metaverse. Ooh we freedom. Ooh we. I was here peace. Ooh Pisces. Pisces. Okay, couple of things here, Pisces. Because I do feel like, Pisces, some of you are just kind of in this energy. You are completely like ignoring, blocking out, and releasing and letting go. I see some of you doing some witchy poo. You manifesting some freedom for yourself. I also feel like someone feels like you've kind of bewitched them, for sure. Pisces, some of you are looking in the mirror doing something. I see this. I don't know what you're doing. Some of you are putting drops in your hair. That's so weird. I put drops in my hair, but I see some of you putting drops. There's a dropper or something that you're putting on. Some of you are doing something magical here. Wish, freedom, and mirror, and letting go. Pisces, are you manifesting some new beginnings here? Pisces, I feel like somebody could also all be as to the side. Somebody could really, 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 like you got them like blocked. And they could be trying to manifest you back. I don't know. Uh, I'm getting some things on this. But Pisces, I, I see you doing something. And I want to know what, you, what it is that you're doing. I don't know if you're doing something in the mirror. If you're whipping up something, a potion. I do see you completely letting go and accepting some freedom, Pisces. Somebody don't want to be let go. And somebody don't want you to be free for some of you, for sure. I feel like I'm going to have to hurry up. Because I feel like it's going to get noisy. My neighbors. So let's get a little clarification. Pass for Pisces perseverance mm -hmm. Pisces I feel like you had to be persistent you had to hold your vision because somebody else couldn't see it current yeah I'm gonna have to hurry up y'all love letter mesmerize I told you somebody wants to sing your song they wants to sing your praises they do they feeling some type of way because you're not listening yeah you're not listening single hood give me one for the future energy oh superficial single hood some of you are looking in a mirror Looking good, taking good. I see you guys taking care of yourself on the outer terms and inner terms. Some of you are definitely decided to let go and move forward. Someone definitely doesn't want you to. Some of you, somebody, I don't know if they are looking at your pictures here. Somebody definitely thinks you're beautiful. Some of you, there's someone still watching and waiting for an opportunity to speak to you. Like, I see them still watching even if you're not communicating, because I feel like they want to sing your praises. All right, I'm going to get some terror on this. I hear my neighbors getting loud. It's going to drive me nuts, y'all. I got to figure out a new place to work. I love you guys. Make sure you throw me the likes, comments, subscribes, and shares. I'm going to try to keep pushing. Give me one on this pass. Pisces, you definitely had to be, you had to hold your vision. You knew about karma. You you knew what was right, what was right from wrong. You had a vision. For the right things, but someone hated on the essence of that, right? They hated on, like somebody. This could have definitely been somebody who tried to like um, with the spiritual hate and perseverance. This could have been somebody who tried to convince you that the things that like the essence of what you wanted and what you were trying to do wasn't right. But I feel like you, you persevered. You did. 
Three of Pentacles is definitely somebody that you had some sort of partnership or or, collab, or collaboration with. The Knight of Pentacles, yep, could have been an Earth sign, long term stability. I do feel like you had the right vision for a long term stable situation here where loyalty and ish was involved, right? With with the strength you were dealing with an extremely stubborn person. For some of you, you had to push through with your plans regardless how how someone else felt or what they said. Now, let's see what this girl, girl told her. There's someone feeling some type of way because you're ignoring them. Now that they want to sing your praises, they want to sing your praises. I just don't know what that means to you, Pisces. But I don't, I feel like, the, I see, yeah, I just see. Because they want to resurrect something, but you're, but you're not listening. They could even, you could even be holding a grudge against them now, too. Give me one for this, Pisces, for the current. The Four of Cups. See someone seeing something as a missed opportunity. This is being bored and discontent. Yep, the Seven of Swords and the Hierophant and, and Justice and the Eight of Cups. Yeah. See, I feel like it's somebody you had to walk away from. Could definitely been a Libra. Yep. And here's the Eight of, the Ace of Pentacles. There is someone that wants to come back and sing your praises. Judgment. They want another chance. But this person could have definitely been sneaky, right? Again, or they were just a hater. Like I said, a sabotager. They could have sabotaged some stuff in the past. Sabotage some stuff for you. Here you go, the Queen of Cups, and here go the King of Wands. See, somebody definitely wanting to come in now and give you attention. They want to sing your praises, but I feel like you're ignoring them. Give me one more for this kind of energy for Pisces. Give me one more for the current. The Nine of Wands, yep. The Wounded Warrior being wounded, guarded. You could be dealing with a fire sign. Yep, Three of Swords, yep. They're sorry. Ace of Swords. Yeah, they Pisces, I feel like they did you wrong. And whether this is third party situation or whatever, but the Ace of Swords is saying yes. Mm -hmm. The fool, they do want to start all over and try to rebuild a situation with you. They're debating about coming your way. They see, they see someone as a soulmate. They do hope to heal something with someone. With you Pisces or you're you them, put it where it goes. Let's get some on this very interesting energy. I want to let's get one on the future energy for fake and block because I do feel like someone is still watching and they may be watching you walk, let go, watching you walk away. It could be hurting them like hell, but I feel like they're still watching, even if you don't want them to. The chariot could be a Cancerian. See, somebody still wants to come forward. Now we have the King of Pentacles and the Queen. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. Pisces, there's a couple. Actually, it could be a very powerful couple here. Right, Pisces, someone could see that you and somebody, whether this is love or business or collaboration, someone could definitely see now that you guys could be a power couple. King of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, right? And they want to come forward. But now they're just having to watch because it's the energy where you're definitely not, you're not listening to the song that they're singing here. So let's see. Let me see what this dance, what this let go this, this witch and this freedom is about. Give me some for this energy for Pisces. I do feel like somebody's manifesting a new beginning for themselves. It's, like, it's a ten of wands, dropping a heavy burden, being free. The hangman, here we go, Pisces, and the two of cups. Pisces, why do I feel like you're starting to feel free? But here's this person, king of pentacles, the empress. Yes, someone doesn't want someone to be free. The hangman and the queen of cups. Yes, they don't. Let me see what all this beautiful super fish. Someone definitely feels like someone is beautiful. They're watching someone. I do feel like some of you are looking in the mirror. You're doing something like mirror magic or you're doing something with your hair, fixing your makeup. Give me some for this for Pisces. The Ten of Swords. This is the worst of something is over. And some of you are definitely starting to look better and feel better behind it. The Magician. There is some sort of master manifestation happening here. And it has everything to do with wish fulfillment. For some of you, this is someone that's wanting to manifest a new beginning towards you. And they want to communicate. For some of you, somebody is watching. If you're moving on and you're giving off this single energy, single sexy free page of swords, someone is watching. I'm trying to tell you. But I do have two tens here. So this is no longer being burdened, no longer feeling oppressed, no longer feel like you're carrying some sort of burden on your own. And the Ten of Swords is like letting it be over. The battle is over. Here, Pisces, put it where it goes. I love you guys. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share. If you're interested in booking, please email me. Take care of yourself. Stay beautiful, stay blessed, and stay high vibing. Bye, Pisces.